it's Charlene and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a very special video because I am going to do an unboxing video of my healing journal. I have it right here. Really excited to show you guys because I am extremely proud of the work that I have done through this book. When I wrote this book, I prayed on it. I meditated, I asked God, for years I've been trying to publish a book. And what better thing to do than educating individuals how to heal from trauma, how to heal from anxiety, depression, whatever they're going through in life. So this is a self-guided prayer journal. And I am going to unbox it. I'm going to show you exactly what's inside, a sneak peek, and Hopefully you guys like it. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. And let's start to unbox this baby. So um, before I unbox this, I want to let you know that this was published on Barnes and Noble. The one and only biggest bookstore brand right now in the market. And I am really excited that this got approved on the Barnes & Noble site and marketplace. So I'm really excited to show you how the Barnes & Noble copy of Healing Journey looks like. A little bit hard to unbox. It's in a very secure package. So you want me, they know that this is not gonna go anywhere. They know this bad boy is not going to be broken. Okay, so I'm unboxing. Now, three, two, one. Oh my gosh, look here she is. This is feeling journal glowing and growing by me, Charlene Areche. I'm absolutely in love hard copy six by nine 92 page self-guided prompts and also open writing sections so that you're able to write your prayers so let's take a look at her so you know I just want to say display wise very vibrant color I, some of the trimming came off of the greens, um, not like my other ones that I posted on Amazon. Um, but overall, I give it really, really good material wise. Very hard, very hard copy we got here. New trimming. The back, this is the back as you can see. It says, God is within her. She will never fail. Psalm 46, 5. All right, so here we go. All right, so we're going to open her up. Okay. So as you can see, it has very strong paper. I think this would be more stronger than Amazon. Very thick paper. Oh, my gosh. Um, I thought there was actually two pages, but it's actually one thick page. You flip over. Um, and then we, here we go. This is the beginning section and where you put your name, this paper, um, this book belongs to. And I have a cross here. Um, so I just want to say I designed and did all of these prompts and editing myself. Um, and with the guidance of the Holy Spirit, I really asked the Holy Spirit to guide me in this journal. And as I write in this journal, um, those of you who know, I'm on a 90 day reset mindset journey. So if you haven't seen those videos, please go click them after this video because I do write in my prayer journal and it really helps start the day. And at night also, I really do this off the camera, the night section one, but at the end of the day, I really reflect, process my day, really understand what I'm going through emotional wise. And then in the morning, I'm able to restart my emotional process as well, process my emotion, check in with myself and see what I need. 
for the day, see my self-improvement, see my goals, see where my weaknesses are as well. Um, so this is the beginning. And this is a little message I have for all my lovely readers out there. So my lovely subscribers, my lovely fans, and my lovely people that follow me on my journey. So here we have Dear Child of God, may your healing start today, renewed and refreshed in each day. May your mind, body, soul find peace, happiness, and inner healing as you strengthen your relationship with God with the use of this healing journal. Let these pages be a testimony of your faith. With love, Charlene and Rachel. And throughout this journal, I have little quotes here from the Bible. So it says, may the Lord bless you and protect you. May the Lord smile on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord show his favor and give you his peace. Number 6, 24 to 26. Then we have more here. For I know my plans I have for you, declare the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Jeremiah 29. And then here we have a section where it guides you on how to write in this prayer journal. So we have a user guide and it long goes with the script, this very detailed script on how to work with this book, how to process your emotions. And it also has, um, so this is another, it has an example, but we'll get to it. So it says, I lift my eyes to the mountains. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot slip. He will watch over you, coming and going both now and forevermore. Psalm 121, my one of my favorite psalms. So here are some examples. So we have, um, so this self-guided prayer prompts here will take you into the deepest level of emotional, spiritual, and also physical healing. So these prompts are designed to give you self-reflection and self-awareness of where your areas need, where your areas of growth need to be. Where are your weaknesses? Where are your strengths? Um, and we also talk about goals for the day. We go into the goal setting. We go into checking in. We go into what you need to surrender to God. We go into improvements. And also, what are you grateful for? Um, what are you doing well? One of the most important things to know is that what is going right in your life? So, and you continue to do that. State your good intentions and stay in that mindset throughout the day. What good deeds are you doing to honor God? And then towards the end, my, one of my favorite parts is state your affirmation. This is where most of the magic happens on the second page. We state your affirmations. We also visualize your success and you stay throughout that. And this will help you dwell in the power of the Holy Spirit throughout the day. You will dwell in God's presence. You will feel the peace and abundance you need in order to continue on. And this will give you the strength. This will give you the empowerment you need to overcome yourself. A lot of things have, a lot of things in psychology that I've learned always say that self-reflection is the most important thing in order to improve your mental health. Not too many people have self-reflection skills. Some people are not open to learning. And this is why it's so important to always be an open book. All right. So as you can see here, this is the Amazon copy and this is a Barnes and Noble copy. So I wanted it to be something that you could have pocket size. So something that you're able to take handy, um, very handy. You could take easily to put in your purse, easy to travel with because I love a prayer journal. I love a notebook that you could have in hand where you could put it anywhere. Um, versus this might take up a lot of space. This might be a little bit more cozy and comfortable on travels. All right, so 
I just want to say that I am extremely proud of this healing journal. Healing journal growing and glowing by me, Charlene Areche. I have really manifested what I wanted for this vision. I wanted individuals, people, women to heal from trauma, to heal from whatever they're going through. I'm actually going to read to you the introduction part. I'm going to be reading to you the healing journal user guide so that you're able to know more about this journal. So, it's easy. Uh, so this journal is intended to help with managing emotions due to trauma, stress, d depression, anxiety, unexpected life circumstances. The body, mind, and soul are all connected. It is important to work within but by being mindful with the help of journaling and prayer in order to find healing, peace, and happiness. The best effective way to use this journal is to do the following writing prompts and techniques in this section daily every night and day as you can see before it has a day and night prompt so they are able to write like i've been mentioning i'm a type of person that writes day and night so in the morning i'm reflecting on my emotions and analyzing self-awareness body scanning and in the afternoon when i come to bed i'm also reflecting on my emotions also analyzing also processing the day and writing that on my prayer journal and then the next um so Sometimes the next day we have things that are still uncertain and unclear. So it's very important that this day by day journal prompt will help give you that clarity you need and you will be able to empty out your mind through writing what you need on these paperwork. Well, these prompts, these journal prompts. Um, the best effective way is to, like I said, day and night and to just practice meditating on God's words. Let's begin. So it says, use a section when praying. So in this step by step, I'm not going to go too in deep, but um, I go step by step on how to write in the prayer writing section. So this is where you're going to write your prayer journal. This is where you're going to write your prayer requests, your prayer. Um, usually for years, I've been writing in my own notebook ruled um, paper on... An, an average notebook and I just write what was on my mind and through the help of prayer writing I have been able to manifest things in my life so this is going to help you manifest this is going to help you in your life this is going to help you achieve goals in your life so I take what I've have been learning throughout the years as well as my clinical guidance on this as well my clinical perspective my clinical knowledge into this and as well as my spiritual knowledge as um in guiding you through this journal so it's very important that you take your time be patient with this success does not happen overnight you create success success is something that comes it flows in when you're open to receiving when you're open to working within yourself so that the universe, so that God is able to reward you for what you have been doing. So keep in mind that if you do good, you continue to do good. Um, so each day, each morning, I am extremely excited to wake up and write in my prayer journal because it really goes step by step on analyzing my life. And like I've said throughout the years, I have had the self-reflection and I've all put it all in one, the spirituality, emotional, and physical self, all in one into this journal. So this journal will take you a long way on your success. So it says, towards the end, I write, make sure to fill your journal with good events in your life as well. So you don't always want to talk about negativity and throughout the day, we want to make sure you have good things. Come to this page for guidance, prayer section of, uh, prayer writing section of your journal. This journal will help bring your inner healing. It shall be the witness to the testimony of your life journey. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So 
I just want to share with you some testimonies that I've seen throughout prayer writing. I've come to write in my own journal um, and I have many of them here in my studio room and I've written some of these testimonies that I now call testimony and I've seen God come through life, come to me, come to manifest all these things in my life. And it's because I've been faithful, I've been patient, I've been obedient as well. Um, I've overcome many obstacles because I was able to self-reflect. It is very important to have self-reflection as something you do in your daily life, in, in your daily spiritual life, so that you can strengthen your relationship with God. So many people ignore the fact of working within because God is within us. Like I mentioned in here, God is within us. It's up to us to decide how we work within. And how do you work within? By first having self-reflection of your emotions, self-reflection of where you stand. And you want to make sure that you are still. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that God is working in your life. And I cannot wait to share with you many more testimonies throughout my life right now. And so stay tuned. Make sure to subscribe to this channel so that you can stay tuned and know more. Um, so get your copy. So get your copy of Healing Journal Glowing and Growing so that you are able to work within. Your healing starts today. You are going to feel, feel, look, and do your best. I promise you that this book will take you a long way into helping yourself. You just really have to be with yourself present daily. Have that self-care. This is a time for you to take action for your well-being, spiritual, emotional, and physical. So take the action by writing in this daily prompt and you will see that you will have many manifestations and testimony from God. All right, guys, so that was it for this video. I hope that you enjoy. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Follow me on my modeling journey and make sure to get your hands on this copy. I will reassure you that you will never doubt having to bought this. And I wanna make sure that you get the best that you can with this. I put my heart, my hard working, my psychological and spiritual self all in here so that it could help you grow with your emotional physical and spiritual self okay um so again it is out now on barnes and noble get your copy today and you will be sure to see some amazing progress in your life all right guys so give this video a thumbs up make sure to follow me on instagram as well and stay tuned i'm going to be showing you more mental health topics and as well share some fashion collabs that i have from rose cal and also i am still on this 90 day journey so i've been completing this task and i want you to come along as well so make sure that you're following my 90 day mindset reset mindset mindset reset 90 day journey so it's really been it's a tongue twister 90 day mindset reset so follow along my journey and i'll see you guys in my next video take care